So over here, you can see that I have some panels right here at the bottom. And then if I were to go around and then resize them right here by clicking and dragging, then what happens is that the panel sticks to each other, as you can see right here. So usually when you're making a storyboard, then this is uh, not a big deal. But if you want to work around with the timing uh, and make an animatics, then um, you might to have some gaps in between right here. So for that, what you can do is you can go around and click on animatic editing mode right here on the bottom, as you can see. So once you do that, what happens is that you can click and drag around uh, the panels freely, as you can see, and place them with gaps, as you can see right here. So if I were to go around right here, it sticks together. But if I were to resize, now you can see that it does not actually stick over there. You can disable this right here. But once you disable this, what happens is that if I were to resize this, you can see that it sticks right there. So now uh, it is separated right now. But if I were to go around and then keep them together, just like this again, then um, uh, what happens is that it will resize um, just like this by sticking to it. But as soon as you click on animatics editing mode again, you can resize and you can see a gap comes up right there. So that's it. And that is how you can use the animatic editing mode inside of Toon Boom Storyboard Pro. So I hope you guys learn something as always. And as always, please like, comment, share, and subscribe.